Oh, where the film starts, um, it's her son's fifth birthday, and she's a young mother but looks slightly tired and worn. And as the story goes on, you see that she has kind of a sparse, small apartment that later you realize um, is a room that she can't leave, and she's been held captive there for seven years. And, and that's sort of the setup for a whole movie where we learn to how to escape and experience liberation in the outside world for the first time. Well, I had about seven months to prep for this, so I spent a lot of time speaking with a trauma specialist about the effects of sexual abuse and what would happen to the brain and how it would organize that type of trauma of also being trapped in a room for seven years. I went on a restrictive diet, um, stayed out of the sun for about four months. Uh, I mean, it was just endless work for about seven months to create her. I couldn't say. I think the, the most beautiful part about this movie is that it's open for interpretation. People seem to be finding different things that are personal to them that they find beautiful about the film. And so I would just love for them to check it out and see what it is for themselves.